Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all doing well. Bit of a different one today. I'm, I've come along to Turton Young Farmers and I'm actually judging their tractor run. So every year they do a tractor run um, to raise money. Last year they rose, rose, I keep saying that. They raised, raised 7,000 pounds for charities that they choose. I'll find out today which charities they're raising it for. Um, so yeah, the, I think they said they've got about a hundred tractors showing up, which they decorate with lights or Christmas, you know, Christmas decorations and that sort of thing. So, and I'm the judge. So yeah, we've just got here. Sam's with me. Hello. Um, <coughs> so yeah, we're just gonna go get a drink and see what the crack is. It snowed here, we've not had snow at home. A little bit of snow, if you're not working in it. Come to get my wallet because we've not got any um, money for raffle. Yeah. Poor lad, we're fuming. <laughs> Probably thought I'm not coming back. <laughs> I've got more euros and put pounds on me. I'll give him some euros. Surely he'd be happy with that. Right, we're just going to go and get a brew. Well, they did hot chocolate. I don't drink brew, so get a little hot chocolate, keep my hands warm, and then let's go and judge some tractors. Right, so we've just come in for a brew and we're just having a look around. So there's a lady here selling all sorts of cakes, which look really good. Some sausage butties, and then there's a, um, a bit of a raffle going on over here. Oh, I like this wreath. That wreath looks a lot better than mine, and I'm really into this ribbon. I might ask her where she's got that from, actually. There's all sorts. Oh, that's a good idea, isn't it? Tickets to go places. I like that idea. Love, we're going to have to buy some tickets. There's some good prizes here. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've got three quid to a name. <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> we're not doing so well. The dog muesli. How cool is that ribbon? I want to know where they've got that from. Right, so we're just buying some raffle tickets from these two ladies. How many can we get for that then? Clean tight. We didn't bring any cash. We've got euros. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank Perfect. You. Thank you. Very good numbers. Right. Should we wait for them to get a bit busier? Okay. Started to snow as well. Not that you can tell. into that. <laughs> oh hell, it's raining. Anyway, uh, right, we're starting with the wagons now. So they're just going to go and all turn the lights on and what have you, so we can see what's what. And then we need to do, is it just a first? Is it what? what? Are we just judging the winner? I think there's only one winner, yeah. Yeah, but we're doing first, second, third, or is it just the winner? I feel like it's just the winner. Right. Well, we don't really know at this point. No, we don't. <laughs> well, we're going to have to not be biased here, because one of my pal's wagons are here. Oh, love. Well, don't tell me which. Okay. And then we're not biased. Right, let's turn you around. Sure, it we're, we're flashes in it. Right, we should be having some... Some flashes on or something. Here we go. <laughs> to be fair, the 
there, love. They've put a lot of effort into that one there. Haven't yeah, they? Yeah. Put a lot of lights up. Candy canes and all that. Tint. Right. We didn't realise they'd done them. Oh, look, with ladder as well. We've done it from the back as well, so. Game changer. He's going Grinch. Putting a them. You've got this. You've got quite a serious job here. It's a very serious job. Right. I like this one because I feel like he's put a lot of effort in here. We've got Santa. Put a life, did you? <laughs> you know, he's wrapped up. True. Right. He's put tinsel, candy canes. He's Santa at the back. He's done a lot on the front as well. So I like that's. That's one of my in the winnings. Oh heck. Right, and that and over there. Which one was that? That green one, I think. Right, we've got Santa here. Squished. Right, Sam put him down as a loser now because he's pushed your eardrum block three times. <laughs> no, I can only rest it. Alright, there he goes. Two ten again. Right, we've picked the winner of the um There's another one here, another wagon here. Of the oh, wagon. Yeah, that's right, as well. Oh yeah, that is pretty good. What about um gators though? She said wag I don't know why, but wagon and gators are in the same class, so I'm just looking for some gators now. No, she didn't say anything about vans. Hmm. Anyway, right, we're going to go on the main field now and have a quick look around them. Right, we're at the front now, judging. So we've like five rows back that we need to start looking at. They've not separated vintage, which is going to be tricky because they could have done with being on one side. But anyway, we'll just have to take notes. Quad bikes, not really sure where they go. Unless they're, they might just be leading it, love. Gators. That's bizarre. They've done a lot of work on that JCB, haven't they? Yeah. We need to take a minute for this one because he's put a lot of effort into that and he's going to be freezing driving round. Anyway, right. I'm trying to get frostbite. <laughs> he is, isn't he? He'll be in a vintage as well and I like how his legs are stuck out at the top so that's a pretty good one. I have to keep note of him. The vintage. Here we go. Yeah, I'm into the what this tractor. Yeah, it looks good. Blairland. Right, he's getting his reindeers on front arms. I like that. Hey, they move. What the hell? Put it moving its head. Trying to graze. <laughs> Hell. That fence looks well. I like a fence. I like Yeah, I liked him as well, but I put him in vintage. Oh, here we go. That's pretty cool. I like that. Santa's sack. Oh, another little vintage. I think the, the vintage ones are just class, I think, because they've gone all out. Get reindeer on front here. What's he got on the back here? Let's put these down for him. Pole, right? Yeah, but we know what it's meant to say. You got your lights on. <laughs> oh, here we go. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're on. <laughs> Oh, this one looks good. Trees aren't lights and everything. 
We're a bit biased with John Deere's, aren't we, really? No, oh, John Deere's the best. Yeah, they are. <laughs> For the vintage here. Yeah? Oh, Christmas tree. <coughs> they used to put these on and all. Showing the vlog. Oh, this looks cool. Reindeer up there. They'll look good when it's properly dark, won't they? what we're waiting for. I like what they've done here. This must take of ages, wasn't it? Right, this this is the one I really like. This is the one I really like. Do they light up? Is is one of this one yours? No. Do you think we could find the lights? We need to turn the lights on. I'm not even filming. Here we go. Right. There we go, he's turned his lights on now. I'm gonna have a look from the front. I like what these have. They all look good. Right, let's look at the front of this one. Because this is one that I really like. Oh, we're not on, on the bonnet yet. Yeah. He's got he's put eyes on it and everything. Well yeah, I know it's Rudolph. Right. Your sister did it. Yeah. Are you going to take all the credit? Are you, are you taking all the credit? No, I'm not taking all the credit for it. All the credit. <laughs> right, so we've judged. There's a lot of effort gone into like all of them to put lights on and like lowering the wheels and all the rest of it. But my winner, which I'll show when it goes dark because it'll probably look the best. So I just think it looks really smart. Although it is a Massey. Although it is a Massey, and we're not Massey fans colour really so it should be green but I think it goes with the theme of what he's done with it so yeah. it's just one of them but he's put a lot of effort into it and it looks really really good right I'll, I'm at the vintage winner now so I'll just spin you around so you can have a look at this this is the winner that we've put for the vintage uh, section Sam's farmer accent. <laughs> farmer accent. There he is. Puts him in. So before we set off, they're just giving everyone a bit of a rules and that. One sec. That's to try and keep everybody in as, as best we can. The only things that we are going to be looking to obviously give way to um, today are emergency services. So if you do see any sirens or Flashing lights, please do pull over best you can. Um, right, they're off skiing. Get to the tractors. Right, let's pick our spot. They're not men. Yeah. These lads are late, so they're not getting judged. Everyone's getting in position. It's 5-2 and they're saying off at 4 on the dot, so they say. What's she going around with music on? That's a good idea.
Right, so this is their final destination. So we we'll just thought we'll come to the pub and then we'll come out and they're all coming past again and watch them because it'll be pitch black then hopefully and we'll be able to get a whoa, better view. Love it stuff here. Jump back in the oh, car. Will. Just abuse your horn. <laughs> There's no kids sleeping in Darwin tonight. <laughs> <sighs> it got absolutely freezing outside, so we're following the convoy back to the farm. To award your prize. To award the prizes. You can't really see us, it's awful filming, but um yeah. So since so we've been standing out on the side of the road and what have you, and the streets are like packed with people. Obviously, everyone from Darwin's come to see it, haven't they? Yeah, it's crazy. Families, kids, like just everyone's out. So it's really nice to see. And there's lots of ladies going around with buckets or elves and is it maybe Santa? No, I don't think there's Santa. I think it's just elves going around with buckets for uh, raising money. So raising money for the the blood bikes, aren't they? Yeah. And, and their young farmers, I think. Yeah. And, but did they not raise seven grand or something last year? Last year, seven grand, yeah. A lot of money. A lot of money. So hopefully this year they can match it, if not do better. That would be good. Um, but yeah, the amount of people that were out was just crazy. Really nice to see. Right, everyone's arriving back at the farm now. I'm just going to go and show you the two winners that I've picked out because the first winner that I'd picked originally I then spoke to the lady who like organised it and he won last year and the one with the tractor class. What? Tractor class one. Yeah, in the tractor class. And the one that I originally picked won last year and it's not that fair so they need to win again. And I think they won last year with the same design that they've done this year, so that makes sense. So we picked another one. Which was very close anyway, so yeah gonna quickly nip down here and show you which ones we've got winning i think they're actually parked next to each other which makes it even easier as well right these are the winners i've picked so this is the vintage class and this is the tractor the main tractor class that i picked put loads of effort into it honey yeah it's a shovel uh 419s and there's lights all over it it's really good isn't it? yeah it looks really good that but well, obviously your wagon isn't here. Wagon's not here, but I've showed it a few times on the video, so yeah. And we're listening to Donk, MC Finty. It's going to get me done for copyright. Right, we're just on our way home now. Well, we're very nearly home. Um, I apologise for the whole lighting situation. You can't really see much. But I just want to say a massive thank you to Natalie from Turt and Young Farmers who asked me to come and judge and be involved in it and all that sort of stuff. Um, and a big well done like that's a lot better thanks um a well done to everyone that's been involved because it's a massive thing to organize that and it was very organized wasn't it 
Yeah. Like the whole run and the way that they did it and all the rest of it. So yeah. And obviously to everyone that entered, it was really good to see so many people getting involved. Um, so yeah, I hope that they've raised lots and lots of money. I'm really looking forward to hearing how much they did raise. Um, I wish that we could have stuck around even longer, but time was getting on and, you know, milking in the morning and that. I need to get to bed. I'm a tired sort of person. Um, so, yeah. Thanks for having me. Thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And if you haven't done already, please do like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Say bye. Bye.